ஹாய் நீட் ஆஸ்பிரண்ட்ஸ் வெல்கம் டு வாரி மெடிக்கல் அகாடமி வாரி மெடிக்கல் அகாடமி சார்பாக அனைத்து விதமான டாபிக் சார்ந்த ஒவ்வொரு வீடியோவும் இனி வரும் நாட்களில் உங்களுக்கு வரும் உங்களுக்கு இதை சார்ந்த சந்தேகங்கள் கேள்விகள் எதுவாக இருந்தாலும் கமெண்ட்ஸில் பாஸ் பண்ணுங்க எங்க எக்ஸ்பர்ட் ஃபேக்கல்ட்டி மெம்பர்ஸ் போடுற வீடியோஸ் பிடிச்சிருந்ததுன்னா ஷேர் பண்ணிக்கோங்க அந்த வீடியோ ரெகுலராக உங்களுக்கு வரணும்னா சேனலை சப்ஸ்கிரைப் பண்ணிக்கோங்க தேங்க்யூ விஸ் ஆல் தி பெஸ்ட் Yeah, good morning students. In the last class, I explained uh, Dalton's law of partial pressure and uh, gaseous loss and ideal gas equation, PV equal to NRT and Van der Waals forces of attraction. And uh, please see the videos. And uh, next, uh, uh, the topic is uh, Graham's law of diffusion. Graham's law of Graham's law of uh, diffusion. diffusion what is the diffusion students uh, diffusion means write the diffusion diffusion a uh, diffusion diffusion is the spontaneous intermixing of spontaneous spontaneous intermixing of intermixing of two or more two or more non reacting gases non reacting gases to form form homogeneous mixture to form homogeneous mixture to form homogeneous mixture is called is called diffusion is called diffusion okay na what is diffusion student spontaneous intermixing of two or more non reacting gases to form homogeneous mixture homogeneous mixture is called diffusion for example air air which contain different gases to form homogeneous mixture now diffusion is the spontaneous process spontaneous diffusion is the spontaneous process and uh, non directional non directional what is the nature diffusion is the spontaneous spontaneous means there is uh, no external agent is required spontaneous process non spontaneous process you know spontaneous means uh, no force is any external agent is required and uh, this is spontaneous and uh, non directional another one <coughs> diffusion a rate of diffusion inversely proportional to under square root of density we can write uh, at constant what are the constant at constant temperature pressure area of diffusion area of diffusion area of diffusion at constant temperature pressure area of diffusion the rate of diffusion r is equal to r inversely proportional to under square root of density what is the what is the diffusion rate of diffusion inversely proportional to under square root of square root of density vapor density molecular weight remember this the diffusion is a spontaneous intermixing of two or more non reacting gases to form homogeneous mixture that is called a diffusion and diffusion is the spontaneous process and non directional there is no direction non directional now what are the constant students the constants are temperature pressure area of diffusion these are the constant the rate of diffusion inversely proportional to under square root of density the density increases means rate of diffusion decreases <coughs> under square root of density now write the the some formulas i will write here next one now what is the formula students rate of diffusion inversely proportional to under square root of density now write down r1 by r2 is equal to under root 
डी टू बाई डी वन नेक्स्ट वन आर वन बाई आर टू इज इक्वल टू अंडर रूट एम टू बाई एम वन मालिक्यूलर वेट नाउ आर वन बाई आर टू इज इक्वल टू अंडर रूट वेपर डेंसिटी वी डी टू बाई वी डी वन ओके ना रेट ऑफ डिफ्यूशन इज इनवर्सली प्रपोर्शनल टू अंडर स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ डेंसिटी नाउ आर वन बाई आर टू इज इक्वल टू अंडर रूट टू डी टू बाई डी वन नाउ वी कैन राइट आर वन बाई आर टू दट इज इक्वल टू अंडर अंडर रूट डी टू बाई डी वन दट इज इक्वल टू अंडर रूट वी डी टू बाई वी डी वन दट इज इक्वल टू अंडर रूट एम टू बाई एम वन एम टू बाई एम वन दीज आर द फार्मूलाज आर यूजिंग फॉर Uh, diffusion numericals what is the students r means rate of diffusion inversely proportional to square root of density there are uh, three cases are present first one is the first case volume of gas volume of gas volume of gas occupied occupied in a unit time volume of gas occupied in unit time now volume of gas rate of diffusion r is equal to v by t r is equal to v by t volume of gas occupied in unit time r is equal to v by t now write down r1 by r2 is equal to here is v1 by v2 into t2 by t1 t2 by t1 this is the first case we can use the volume of gas occupied in unit time then is the r is equal to v by t r1 by r2 is equal to v1 by v2 into t2 by t1 and this formula sir this formula and this formula and this formula based on they are given in numericals it is useful and next one is <coughs> another uh, case means volume of gas is occupied in unit time and uh, and distance traveled uh, distance traveled uh, distance traveled by gas by gas in a uh, unit time unit time what is the second case students the second case is distance traveled by gas in unit time already you know rate of diffusion is equal to l by t l is equal to distance traveled t is equal to time now r1 by r2 is equal to l1 by l2 into t2 by t1 t2 by t1 this is the and third case in uh, in third case this is the second case now the another one third case number of moles number of moles uh, diffused number of moles diffused in unit time in unit time number of moles diffused in unit time now what is the formula r is equal to n by t what is n number of moles diffused in unit time now write the formula r1 by r2 is equal to n1 by n2 into t2 by t1 these are the three cases remember students what are the cases first one is the volume of gas occupied in unit time r is equal to v by t now r1 by r2 is equal to v1 by v2 t2 by t1 the second case is distance traveled by the gas in unit time r is equal to l by t and the third case is number of moles diffused in unit time that is equal to r is equal to n by t r1 by r2 is equal to n1 n1 by n2 into t2 by t1 these are the diffusion formulas are useful while you are taking the doing the numericals actually it is j is very very important but neat also sometimes are asking now what is the diffusion students the diffusion is the spontaneous intermixing of 
टू आर मोर नॉन रियाक्टिंग गैसेज टू फॉर्म ओमोजीनियस मिक्सचर एट कॉन्स्टेंट टेम्परेचर एंड एरिया ऑफ डिफ्यूशन एंड द रेट ऑफ डिफ्यूशन इज इनवर्सली प्रपोर्शनल टू अंडर स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ डेंसिटी the from the formula is this one also you have to remember this formula under root d2 by d1 under root v d2 vapor density molecular weight and density and rate of diffusion next one is the another important one is effusion diffusion is completed next one effusion what is effusion effusion also write the effusion effusion a diffusion of gas diffusion of gas diffusion of gas through through small hole small hole or tiny tiny hole from from higher pressure to from higher pressure to lower pressure lower pressure that is called effusion and don't uh, confuse the diffusion and effusion and uh, effusion means the diffusion of gas diffusion of gas through small hole remember small hole or tiny hole from higher pressure to lower pressure for example here i am taking here i am taking 10 atm of oxygen this is the vessel another vessel also they are combining if it is i creating a small hole small hole means रेट ऑफ द डिफ्यूशन ऑफ गैस थ्रू द स्मॉल होल स्मॉल होल दिस इज अ वेरी वेरी स्मॉल होल फ्रॉम हाइयर प्रेशर हाइयर प्रेशर मीन्स इयर इज टेन टेन ए टी एम इयर इज जीरो ए टी एम नाउ हाइयर प्रेशर टू लोअर प्रेशर दैट इज कॉल्ड एफ्यूशन नाउ रेट ऑफ एफ्यूशन रेट ऑफ एफ्यूशन inversely and directly proportional to directly proportional to rate of effusion directly proportional to pressure pressure is variable pressure rate of effusion rate of effusion directly proportional to pressure inversely proportional to inversely proportional to inversely proportional to the square root of density square root of density square root of density remember rate of effusion is directly proportional to pressure inversely proportional to square root of density now temperature and area of diffusion is constant and pressure is variable which one is variable pressure is variable what are the constant temperature area of effusion area of effusion remember students what is effusion diffusion of gas through small hole or tiny hole from higher pressure to lower pressure that is called effusion here i am taking the one vessel then two two separate partitions are there here is a 10 atm oxygen i am taking here is higher pressure to lower pressure through very small hole that is called effusion in effusion rate of effusion is directly proportional to pressure directly proportional to pressure inversely proportional to density these are the points you have to remember next to what are the formulas of effusion effusion formulas write down rate of effusion 
रेट ऑफ एफ्यूशन डायरेक्टली प्रोपोर्शनल टू प्रेशर इनवर्सली प्रोपोर्शनल टू स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ डेंसिटी नाउ आर वन बाई आर टू इज इक्वल टू पी वन बाई पी टू इन टू अंडर रूट डी टू बाई डी वन नेक्स्ट वन आर वन बाई आर टू दट इज इक्वल टू पी वन बाई पी टू इन टू अंडर रूट वेपर डेंसिटी वी डी टू बाई वी डी वन नेक्स्ट टू आर वन बाई आर टू दट इज इक्वल टू पी वन बाई पी टू इन टू अंडर रूट एम टू बाई एम वन वाट इज एम मालिक्यूल आर मास नव एम राइटिंग हियर आल कामेशन आर वन बाई आर टू दट इज इक्वल टू पी वन बाई पी टू अंडर रूट अंडर रूट टू डी टू बाई डी वन दट इज इक्वल टू पी वन बाई पी टू अंडर रूट वी डी टू बाई वी डी वन नेक्स्ट नेक्स्ट दट इज इक्वल टू पी वन बाई पी टू इन टू अंडर स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ एम टू बाई एम वन दीज फार्मूलास आर बाई यूजिंग एफ्यूशन प्रॉब्लम्स एफ्यूशन Sometimes they are given density or vapor density or molecular mass. Effusion and diffusion. Don't confuse the effusion and diffusion. Diffusion is the spontaneous process and effusion is the unidirectional. Effusion is the unidirectional. Effusion is the unidirectional. Unidirectional. In effusion, what are the constants? Temperature and area is constant. Temperature and area of diffusion, area of effusion is constant. What is variable? A variable is uh, pressure. Pressure is variable. And these are the Graham's law of diffusion. and very very less chances they are asking question from neat but je means exam they are asking and graham's law of diffusion and partials dalton's law of partial pressure numericals and graham's law of diffusion numericals and gaseous laws graphs and gaseous laws problems and pv is equal to nrd problems and refer all the best to your preparation for neat 2023